Hello everybody, today I'm going to show you how to wash your climbing rope in a washing machine. You should always take good care of your climbing rope because it's your safety line and you should wash it when it's dirty, it will increase the lifespan of it. Of course you can wash it in the bus stop with your hand, but why not use a washing machine if you have one? The other two is to wash your rope in the washing machine. First is to put it in a laundry bag and second is to tie a chain knot. This is a 15 meter rope and I have tied a chain knot which makes it like 4 meters long literally. So I'm going to show you how to tie a chain knot now. It's a very useful and practical knot, you can tie it with any rope like a sling for example and this is a 240 centimeters and it opens like this so by doing it you just create a loop and you do the rope through and create another loop and it says another you just keep doing the same thing over and over and over this makes the 240 centimeter long sling this long like 30 centimeters and I'll do it with my other climber, of course I'm going to watch them together. This is a 40 cm one. Another trick to make it even shorter is to start with the both ends. You can do this when you close the rope as well. It saves half the strength and makes it much quicker. So we're going to tie a chain knot now. We make a loop. Just keep going. Keep going, this way. It's just so that process. At the end of it, you tap it in, so it won't open. And now the 40 meter rope has become something like very short, like 3 meters. Okay. Now I'm going to put these two ropes in the washing machine. After you put your rope in the washing machine, choose the mode. If you have any delicate mode or like wool or silk, you should choose it and it's better to put it like 30 degrees and no drying don't dry your rope and another thing that can potentially damage your rope which is the uh, this tray the chemical residuals that's left in the tray you should wash it if possible if you notice it's dirty um, so don't put any detergent or some washing powder especially some like uh, bleach in the washing machine or petrol you can use the uh, specialized rope cleaner but if you don't want to buy them you can use a shower gel, especially like the sensitive one, or shampoo. If your body, your skin can take it, your rope should be able to take it as well. Now you finish washing the rope. The last step is to hang and dry it. Don't pack it in your duffel bag before it's completely dry. And also, don't dry it under the sun. Directly under the sun will make it dry quicker, or the UV ray will really hurt the rope. And the advantage of the chain knot makes it much easier to hang and dry. You don't have to stretch all your 70 meters rope all over. And you can just hang anywhere and let it dry. Oh, the last thing, beware of the cat. He bites me, so don't hand it here. He might bite the rope. 